Hello, we are on a trip to the elephant bedroom in Kenya and Samburu. The weather is awesome, it's like 28 degrees and this is our last proper trip before we go home, 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 home. Yeah, I'm really excited, but also I'm really excited about today. We just here on the entrance, get some tickets to go through the safari bit and then it's another 19 minutes to the elephant bedroom. And there's like tents with the pool and the elephants live there, but I'll show you everything later. But yeah, can't wait. That's really warm. What's an elephant in there? It's pretty cold now. I'm so scared. But it's supposed to be a snake or something. Do you like it? Natürlich ganz am Ende. Aber vielleicht können wir den Fluss noch besser sehen. Cute. Oh, what's that? Yeah, ferrets. No, not like ferrets, they're so like uh, voles. <laughs> Let's go check it out. Oh, that's really cool. Yeah, it's really cool. That's cool. Okay. Yes, what? Safe box? Yeah. Laundry basket? Yeah. Also drinking water? Yeah. And a uh, shower. Okay. Yeah. Cool, thank you. Can we use them? Yeah, it's easy. Just open it at that. Open it at pool. Yeah. Cool. Okay. <laughs> That's really easy. That's okay. Cool. So we just arrived at Elephant Bedroom and it's really cool, isn't it? It's like a tent with a bed and everything in there. And we have a little pool. We're directly on the lake. And I think it's really nice, isn't it? This is this, we even have like the um, mosquito repellent here. Okay, yeah. This is our bed. It's kind of cool, isn't it? Yeah, I like it. It's re just really warm. That's all. Just warm. It's warm. We go in there after lunch. Cool, yeah. Straight on nature's door. So we've been told as well to make sure we secure the tent with a lock uh, and zip it down and lock it because the monkeys know how to open the tents and steal all your food. So we need to make sure that's locked before we go to lunch. And you hope you see some elephants here, they've come apparently really close, so we see. Fingers crossed. We'll see. And they said in the night we should not be alone walking around when, the, when it's dark. Somebody will get yeah, us. Yeah, we've got to use a flashlight, shine yeah. in the direction over there, uh, and the guard will come and escort us wherever yeah. we need to go. So yeah. So we just step out to have some food.
We have yeah. to go. Yeah. Oh. Okay. <laughs> we have to go. What is coming? Um. Okay. Should I go? Okay. Yeah. We have to go back. This is this is Onyango. It's very more elegant lunch. Yeah. So we got so lucky to see this elephant. Uh, we just had lunch, then we had to go up just in case. But this was just awesome. We got very, very lucky. <laughs> Yes, the washrooms. Mm, that's good. Okay, it's like a temper bar. So we just want to go to our room, but the elephant is in our way, so we can't go to our room and have to wait a little bit. He's just eating his way around. Yeah, we just sit here, but the view is so gorgeous. So nice. And it's so warm. Can't wait to go in a pool though. Yeah. yeah. You never meet one of them in the cup. Ah, oh, they always come. Yeah, we have that, that one is called Onyango. Onyango? Onyango, yeah. Oh, it's good you tell us that. We also have Mangati. Yeah. We have Obama. Obama, yeah. We have Uncle Sam. We have uh, Bamba. Yeah. And we have Tom. Okay. Yeah. And they always come here. Yeah, they always come here. You never miss one of them in the car. They always show off. Yeah. <laughs> he was good. He came for lunch. Yeah, he came for lunch. <laughs> Just to show off. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Then the best thing happened, the elephant walked past our tent and uh, had some lunch. Really really cool, so we could see him really from our tent, this was amazing. We got so lucky, very very lucky. This is in the night time, very dark, our way to the food. We get escorted. We get escorted. And we are hungry. So we just walked back and the guy said who um, guide us back to the tent. He said, listen to this, this is a lion. And we hear the noises of a lion. And he's literally there. About 20 meters away. So the whole night when I tried to sleep, I heard the lion roaring. Roaring? Roar? <laughs> but it came so close, was so close. I got really really scared so I literally I think I only had like three and a half hours sleep and it was so windy as well well I kept my husband awake he wasn't happy but yeah this was my night because I was so scared I got eaten by a lion literally <laughs> If you 
if you stand up, it's okay. Cool. That's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Can I give a gut shiver for Yeah, we got it. Hey. <laughs> okay, cool. Okay. <laughs>